Now we're going to paint our stylized landscape paintings. You can use any materials you have. Don't forget, you can use markers, markers and a brush with water to turn them into watercolors. You can use color pastels, acrylic paint, color pencils. I'm going to be using a regular watercolor palette. You can blend colors by putting a darker color around the outline and then taking a lighter color and water and blending them together till they meet. I usually will start with a darker color on one side and then a lighter color on the opposite side and blend them in the middle while they're still wet. That's really important. This is called wet into wet blending. If you place down a color and don't blend it, it'll usually show or stain the paper and sort of maintain that blotchy kind of look. And in this area, I use yellow stripes and then red stripes in between and kind of giving it a little bit of a texture. On the flower petals, I did a stripe of orange to make one edge look like it's darker, and then the other side was kept lighter with a yellow. And then I'm just sort of alternating blue and yellow in this area. And then in my water area, I'm going to actually use what's called a stippling technique and sort of blot this paint down and I'm sort of stabbing the paper and trying to get texture marks from the brush onto the paper rather than just putting on a straight color. And the last thing you can do is really just get a lighter version of any of your colors on the palette using water. So the more water you use, the more see-through the color will be and the lighter it'll be. And in this area, I painted way too much, so I'm just blotting it with a little paper towel. Remember to post these to Artsonia and wash your hands. Have fun, kids.